Are you having a difficult time falling asleep at night because you're having sleeping problems? Then this video is for you because I'm going to share practical tips on how you can sleep better by overcoming the most common problems that are stopping you from getting a good night of sleep so you can wake up well rested with full of energy. The first common problem is overthinking. It's when your mind is racing with a lot of thoughts and you're thinking too much. 90% of our problems are created by overthinking, so you're creating a problem that wasn't even there in the first place. This drains your mental energy, causing you to have regrets about the past or feeling anxious and worried about the future. So what can you do to calm your mind? Journaling by writing down your thoughts helps you to clear your mind and reflect over your current life situation. To finish off the day in a positive state of mind, you can write down your answers to these three questions. What three positive things happened today? What three things are you grateful for in your life? How could you have made today even better? In this way, you're always reflecting so you can improve to the next day. Deep breathing exercises is a great way to shift your focus from random thoughts to your breath. If you're a beginner, then there's an app called Headspace that shows you deep breathing exercises and guided meditations. The second problem is FOMO, which stands for fear of missing out. This makes you stay on your phone or computer later than you should be because you don't want to miss out on the latest updates on social media and you want to know what's going on around you 24-7. The light from the screen is also disturbing the production of melatonin, which is your body's way of making you feel sleepy. The solution to this is to set an alarm when to turn off your electronics, at least 30 minutes before you go to bed. Replace your electronics with a book. Go through your planner to mentally prepare for the next day and write a list of the things you want to get done. You can also prepare your bag, your outfit or food for the next day, which will save you extra time in the morning. The third problem is not having regular sleep habits. When you're going to bed at different hours all the time, then your body have no time to adjust to a sleeping routine and with no habits established, it's harder to be physically tired at a certain time, so you stay up because you're not feeling physically tired. The solution to this is to create a sleep schedule where you go to bed at a reasonable hour. Remember to go to bed at the same time every day so your body gets used to it. Practicing yoga is an amazing way to stretch and relax the body before you go to sleep. There is a wonderful video that shows you yoga exercises you can do before bed and I will leave the link to that video in the description box. What time do you go to sleep? Let me know and leave a comment below. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you next time. Good night!